Good evening. Good evening. Good evening, Principal Breaker, teachers, staff, families, and of course, my friends. I am Ryan Jackson, and it is a privilege to be this year's valedictorian. It is an honor to speak to all of you today. I would like to start with a prayer. Please bow your heads to pray. Dear Lord, thank you for allowing everyone to be here today, and thank you for this day of graduation. Please guide us epiphany graduates as we journey to high school and allow us to grow in our faith and live with integrity and kindness. Please bless, bless our epiphany family. In Jesus' name, amen. One of my favorite verses is from Psalms 32, verse 8, which is, I will instruct you and teach you in the way you should go. I will counsel you with my loving eye on you. This verse is about how God loves us and guides us. Now, one of my reasons I am proud to be here at Bethany is because it is like a family. I'm appreciative of my experiences here and the things I was here to accomplish through the help of my teachers and fellow classmates. I want to thank the people who have led me on this journey. Thank you, Mom and Dad, for enrolling me into this school and how you took the time to help me with school work and projects. Both of you would always tell me never to give up whenever I couldn't figure something out. Y'all never gave up on me, and I spent so much, and you spent so much time with me. I would like to also thank the teachers, starting with Mr. Jumeric. Thank you for teaching us and spending time with us to take us to field trips. You would always say bad jokes along with bad times as well. <laughs> you were always greeting us in the morning. Go to help with Jack. Next is Mr. Dewar. Thank you for being our teacher and teaching us. You were always cheery and at ease. When you were a seventh grade teacher, well, our seventh grade teacher, we would always have fun, and we still have fun in your classes. You also help with sports like soccer, basketball, and sometimes track when Mr. Jamera couldn't make it. <laughs> principal Fraker, thank you for being a teacher and a principal. You have done many great things for the school, and you have taught some of us algebra. And you were always there to greet us every day in the morning, along with Ms. McManus. Mr. Wilkie, thank you for being our VE coach and taking the time to coach sports like basketball and track. Thank you for also being a teacher and for homeroom. I would also like to thank the elective teachers, Mr. Josh, Ms. Yeaman, and Mrs. Tamburello. Mr. Josh, thank you for teaching technology. You are great at teaching technology and you always seem to have fun teaching it. Mrs. Yaman, thank you for teaching band, and I hope you continue to teach amazing music. Mrs. Tamborello, thank you for teaching worship and choir. The last person I want to thank is our fifth grade teacher, Mrs. Chapman. Thank you for teaching us back in fifth grade. I am so thankful for this family here at Epiphany Lutheran School. Four years ago, I came to this school and joined Mrs. Chapman's class. I learned so much and had unique experiences from field trips like George Ranch, where we learned about the pioneer days on Texas ranches where we saw things like ranch houses and pens. We had many projects that helped us learn, like the Wax Museum where we dressed up as people in history and presented information about the people we chose. Recently, we had our academic showcase where the eighth graders did things with science. But before this, we, have, we used to have science fairs where we would figure out how science works in our universe around us. One of my favorite places we went to was called Outdoor Education. At Outdoor Ed, we did fun activities and worship God. I always remember how the prayer before the meal would be like a song, like a childhood song. It was great where we did devotions and had challenges where we had to work together. One of the trips that some people in the band went to was concert at the LHN that we did where we would work for hours on music and perform for and before concerts. We would also go to Lutheran High North, now called North Academy, 
where we would watch plays and have field trips there. Here at Epiphany, we would have a chapel service where we would worship God and have devotions. Some more yearly activities we did were the fun run and the penny wars. At the fun run, we would run to raise money for the school, and the penny wars were also for raising money. Some of us went to Washington, D.C., where we saw many historical things, like the Capitol Building, the Washington Monument, National Archives, National History Museum, the American, the African American Museum, and the Native American Museum, and more. We all had a good time in Washington, D.C. There was so much to learn. We have many friends here in Disney, and high school awaits, where we will learn more things and make new friends. So many memories from one place. Finding out about his, the finding out about the history of the U.S., the science of the world and the universe around us, learning and worshiping God, learning and solving equations and formulas. I'd like to thank my classmates for making middle school fun and eventful. Epiphany has been trying to get us ready for high school wherever we go. Now that we have passed all the challenges of Epiphany, it's time that we move on to high school. This whole time that we were here at Epiphany, we were being prepared for high school in different places. Today, we are, graduated, we are graduating from Epiphany Lutheran. Tomorrow, we start our new adventures. Each student has had help along this journey. I say that those students should thank those who have helped them on our journey to high school. Thank you for this. Thank you for this time.